A West Columbia animal shelter is trying to recover after being hit with back-to-back -back thefts last week. They were days away from launching a mobile vet clinic to help those in need. But as Julia Kaufman reports now, they're the ones looking for help. Pets Inc. in West Columbia was gearing up to launch a full-service vet clinic on wheels to serve rural communities. It is uh, fully equipped for us to do surgeries and uh, clinic services for animals out into the public. So our goal was to take our mission and our low-cost uh, clinic services out into rural areas. But Dana Vincent, a director with the shelter, says that mission halted when the catalytic converter was stolen from their new van. We had another trial run set up um, in a couple of weeks, which we are not able to do now because we don't have that van, so that's pretty sad. According to police, catalytic converter thefts have been a growing issue in South Carolina. What we've seen over the last several months is an increase in this, and that's because the metal that is made or used to make the catalytic converters is so valuable now. Captain Adam Myrick with the Lexington County Sheriff's Department says a business right by Pets Inc. also reported a stolen catalytic converter recently. Here's how he suggests protecting your car. Park in a well-secured and then in a well-lighted area. Now for those second steps, you can take your car to your mechanic and see if there's a way to use a secure bolting or some sort of a bracket underneath your car. The night after Pets Inc. noticed the car part was stolen, someone had broken into their facility. Pets Inc. provided us this surveillance video of a man that Lexington County deputies now say they want to talk to. We saw that on Saturday night after the last manager had left that somebody did come inside of the building. Um, they stole some equipment from our offices. Police don't know if the two thefts are connected, but say to call Crime Stoppers if you have any information on either. Pets Inc. is asking for the community's help to recover so they can get back to their mission of serving rural areas. For more information on how you can help Pets Inc., head to WLTX.com.